and welcome to Kentucky Brew Reviews. I'm Radar. Special K, and tonight we're doing Michelob Ultra's Organic Seltzers. If you're not familiar with these, Michelob Ultra just came out with these seltzers. They are part of their signature collection, they the are. first edition, meaning they're probably, uh, if they sell well, they'll probably make more flavors. That's going to be interesting. These particular flavors are spicy pineapple, cucumber, lime, and peach pear. Anyway, 80 calories, zero sugar, zero carbs. Slim cans. Let's start out with the worst one. Good choice. I know, right? Uh, as I... always, <laughs> start out with the one we think is the worst. Now, I actually like cucumber drinks. Shut up. I think they're great. Really? Because have we ever had a good cucumber drink? No, no, on the no. Show? Not, not these necessarily. Uh, I like cucumber water. I, I like to throw a little cucumber in the water. Do you water. remember one of our very first videos? I had that random can of cucumber. It was a cucumber alcoholic beverage. Um, yes. It was the literally the worst thing we had ever yes. had. Yes. Oh, it still God. probably is today one of the worst things we've ever had. I don't know. We had show Bud system. Light iced tea. Remember that? That was bad. <laughs> uh, yeah, hey. that's about the color I expected it to be. It's, a, it's kind of a whitish clear. It's not quite clear, but it's not a yellowish clear. Do you remember in like... The early 2000s cucumber melon lotion? The no, lotion that was cucumber I melon? I don't recall that. People know what I'm talking about, cucumber melon. I'm sorry to hear that. Smell that. This is cucumbers that have been sitting in the refrigerator just a little bit too long. That's like cucumber skin. It's, it's, I don't get lime in there. It does smell like cucumber and some sort of fruit, but it's, that's not lime. Well, uh, you know, it could be good, though. Kind you know, footy cucumber. You know what's going to be hard to top? Those founder seltzers? Like, as far as seltzers go, price available, uh, price and taste, those were some of the best. Why did you pour me so much? I have to drink this. Um, that is so flavorless. Uh, yeah. A little, little bit of citrus on the very end. That is the, that is the, the most flavorless seltzer I've ever had in my life. There's literally nothing there. Just a touch of cucumber that sort of flows throughout, and then on the end you get a little bit of a spike. You can tell there's zero carbs and zero sugar in it. You certainly can. This is a certainly bubbly water. Um, cucumber flavor is kind of building up over time. It honestly just tastes like, I mean, it tastes like water. Yeah. With, like, something that, like, maybe you, like... Had alcoholic beverages, you rinse your glass out, but only once. Some, yeah. <laughs> only once, and then you poured something else in it. Somebody soda streamed their water from a really old house. Or you the had water lotion on your in for a you while. had lotion on your hands, and then you stirred your drink with your finger. You got to get off the cucumber-scented lotion, man. It's just, it's not healthy. It's honestly for something that's 80 calories and you know zero carbs, or whatever. It's 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 not bad at all. I mean, granted, there is like almost no flavor but it does have the highest quality ingredients there's like a there's it's like it's a, just the flavors are unexpected i'm assuming when they mean unexpected as in there isn't actually any flavor i didn't expect this to taste like nothing um because like <laughs> it's crisp which is nice uh, -huh. uh it doesn't have any funk in there which is nice but it also doesn't have any flavor there's uh, like a there's like a sweetness that's building up in my mouth as i'm drinking this like a like an oily kind of sweetness I don't know what that is. It's like sticking to the inside of my mouth. I will say this is the cleanest seltzer I've ever had. It is. Um, the cleanest. You could you could knock that back. Yeah. Uh, and just drink the whole can. Maybe shotgun it. I don't know. Do your thing. Whatever whatever works well, for sure you. I'm sure Steel will drink the rest of these. I'm things. fairly certain he will. In fact. Um. If you really drank them after a minute, you start to get like a little like. A little bit of that malty seltzeriness, but I mean, you have to be looking for it hard. Like, you have to be reviewing yes, it. Yes, if I was doing anything else that required any amount of thought, I wouldn't I wouldn't even notice. Uh, like I'm going to go ahead and rate that uh, a five? It's like, it's not bad, but also it doesn't have any flavor. It's it's very middle of the road. I'm, I'm going to rate it a four. Fair. I'm going to rate it a four. It's It's... Got a just a very a fine hint, and by fine I mean very thin hint of of some flavors in it. And the, to be fair, the flavors are exactly what they said they were going to be. Barely. Um. To be fair, this entire can, the only thing in it is 
five grams of sodium. Get you some salt. Some salt in your beverage. On to the uh, spicy pineapple. Oh, I was gonna save that for last. Judge, well, I think it's, uh, I think it's gonna be at least good. And judging by the flavor of the last one, I doubt you're gonna get any spiciness. In I was, here at all. I was gonna save that for last just because spicy pineapple. <laughs> I mean, I like spicy and sweet things. I, so I'm, I'm okay with that. Rice. Rice. Malted rice. Malted rice. Okay. Cane sugar and malted rice. Malted cracked rice. You gotta have. All right. It does smell very pineapple. -y. Yes, it does. <laughs> that, that smells good. Like. Oh, I'm, that smells. That I like that. I mean, it's definitely pineapple jello. Like pineapple jello smell. It's strong. It's a strong. I scent. like the smell. That's. But you know what's going to be disappointing when, nice. when, when you taste it and there isn't any flavor. <laughs> no, no, I mean, I kind of expect that, but the smell is really nice. I, I, I would like for like an air freshener in my car to smell like that. All right. Substantially more flavor than the other one. A whole lot more, yeah. Like way more. Oh, I just spit on myself. I don't know where they're talking about spicy. Nope, this is just pineapple-y. I'm trying to get spicy. I'm not. This might be the best pineapple seltzer I've ever had. But I'm not getting spicy. I think Maybe they were talking about the bubbly-ness of the seltzer. Well, then why wasn't it spicy cucumber lime? Uh, because that sounds weird. That sounds a little so weird. So spicy can, pineapple. I mean, you can have pineapple with, uh, with stuff on it. I felt like saying spicy would turn more people off than just... Saying pineapple. It really is just pineapple. Um, I don't know what spice they're claiming is in here. I, does it does it say anywhere? It's got like the ghost of a chili in it or something. Maybe some some peppercorns were sitting next to it while it was being made. I think somebody <laughs> dropped a, a just a jalapeno, not dice, no nothing. <laughs> Skin on just dropped it in there for a second. Oh, we gotta call it spicy. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's in the entire batch. They just got a pepper on a string and. Dropped it in there for a minute. I might be getting a little heat in my esophagus, but it could be just carbonation. <laughs> See, I, I think it's just the carbonation that they're talking about when they say spicy. Though that is a pretty good pineapple uh, seltzer. What do uh, you. Uh, seven. A seven? You know, it, that's. I think that's actually fair. That, uh, is, that is a good pineapple seltzer. Oh, wait, they've got pictures of everything. See, this one's got cucumber and lime, and this one's got pear and... I don't know what that is that is spicy, though. Maybe that's like... Powder? Some sort of... It's like... It's a piece of pineapple, and then a piece of pineapple with red stuff on it. Like red liquid. I don't know, man. I got no spiciness. Seven. I think I will also give this a seven. I it, This is... I'd probably give as... it a seven and a half if it was actually, like, had spicy to it, just because... Um, it, it, it needs to be what it says it is. Yeah, there is no but spicy still, in this. it's still really good, though. That's, that is not bad at all. I'm, I'm pleasantly surprised. On to uh, this. I think this one's going to be the best peach one. Peach pear. But we'll find out. I don't know. It's going to be hard to follow. Getting drunk off water. Hey, hey. <laughs> that alcoholic water. Mmm. Yummy. So peach pear flavor. I'll just uh, uh, give you some. Do you need another one? Hold on. <laughs> you might as well pour the whole thing, right? That is the fakest peach wow. I've ever smelled in my life. <laughs> now pear is a pretty, pretty submissive flavor. I'm mean, gonna say. Um, that's a that's a peach ring uh, scent. That is the fakest peach I've ever smelled in my this life. This is like some Kroger brand peach rings in a, in a liquefied form. I love how they're like, it's organic, and that, that is that is very fake. Um, hmm. Wait, wait. I think I'm getting some heat. I think I'm getting some heat. I think I think I am. I think you just probably need a burp. I think I might be getting a little bit of heat. I got no heat. Um, God, it's so fake. That smells exactly like a bag of peach rings I got for Christmas this year. Uh, more, more soapy. For, it smells more soapy to me. But all right, let's do it. Mm, it's a little perfumey. 
strong flavor, but very kind of perfumey. Um, yeah, that it's got a little bit of a chemical sort of feeling not after getting, the aftertaste. Not getting pear in there. It's all peach all day long. Mm -hmm. Yep, no pear. But I don't understand how you can put peach and pear in the those same are, drink yeah, and be are, like, "Yes, this is you're gonna you're gonna be able to detect pear in this." You'd have to pair. You'd have to pair <laughs> pear with something <laughs> a little bit more subtle. You know? I will murder you. <laughs> You've been thinking about that all day. I didn't. You? That was an accident, actually. Um, yeah, it have it have to be paired with something a little bit uh, t uh, tamer than peach. Peach is a strong flavor. Um. Oh yeah, that chemical flavor. That's yeah, chemical. That, that it smells okay. You know those uh, those aerosol. Yes. Um. Um. Scents. Did you breathe in it? Did you breathe it in while you were walking? Someone. Back? Someone sprayed it in a room, and you walk in and go, "What is that?" It's uh. It's it smells. It tastes like somebody just sprayed a lot of perfume in a room. It's very flavorful though. It has a lot of flavor. It's just it's a ton of flavor compared to this. I mean, what happened with this one? Like, well, you know, you got okay. You got different different things for different people. Hint of hint of flavor, some good flavor, and then a lot of flavor, a lot of flavor for a seltzer. Uh, I'm gonna go with a four and a half on that one. Mmm. I'm gonna go with a three. That's not good. That's not appetizing at all. Very, I don't. Very, I don't very like this polarizing pack. Mm. Um, yeah, the peach is just too fake, and there is no pear. Pear pear is a nice flavor. I like pear, but like it is a very subtle flavor. So it, yeah, it doesn't work with peach. Uh, it, that aftertaste is still in my mouth. Yeah, it doesn't go away. Wait till <laughs> you start burping later. It's gonna be only peach. Um. So the pack as a whole, do we recommend it? Well, it is eighteen dollars, seventeen ninety nine, uh, which is high. You're only getting three flavors versus four. It but is organic. There the are people only is, eat and drink organic. It's stuff. effing water. Like <laughs> that's true. I can't change that. You can't change it. But it's organic. <laughs> it's also the trade off is it's four percent alcohol. Um, yeah, that's so, true. Uh, so you're paying more for less alcohol um, and one less flavor. Um, do I think these could be good? Absolutely. I think uh, if they make some more flavors, because um, it's nice they're doing unique flavors. If they do some more flavors and if they drop it to like $16.99, mm -hmm. it, would, it would feel less painful to buy it. It's still higher than regular seltzers, but it's not like obscene and i bought it at total wine so you know everywhere else it's probably mm. gonna be like 19.99 or 18.99 you know this so. uh this spicy pineapple really rescues me from the from the perfuminess <laughs> so the pack as a whole um i think it's worth a try uh i'm gonna give the pack as a whole a six um the cu the cucumber mount uh, cucumber lime is just a quick knockback so that would be like you already smashed you start out with your or you start out with your pineapple Drink two or three of those, switch to um, your cucumber when you're a little buzz, you taste a little bit, and then when you have no, you don't care anymore, then you can drink the You have not the a peach. care in the world, it's time to yeah, start so, with the, uh, uh, the peach. But, you know, there are better seltzers out oh, there. I, I'll give it a, uh, I'll give it like a, like a, I want to give it a five, but I want to give it slightly less than a five because that, that peach flavored drink not so good. I want to give it like like a four and three quarters, halves or or holes. I don't. I'll give it a four and a half. I, I, I yeah. That that peach flavored drink is not okay with me. No. They have potential. I would say that out of all the seltzers I've had, very few of them. I'm like these could be good on the next batch. Like um, maybe we'll do like a single elimination thing where Michelob will release the next pack and they'll just get rid of. The, uh, the peach flavor entirely and they'll keep the other two and it'll be just like every single time they'll eliminate a flavor that no one likes because no one's going to like that. Yeah, I mean somebody who likes eating perfume will like it. Well, that's, there's probably a TV show that centers around that. I don't know. Alright, well that's been our episode. If there's something you'd like to see on the channel, you can leave a comment right there. 
Don't forget to hit that like button. I'm Special K. And I'm Radar. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.